Steve Bing's family is speaking out less than a day after the film producer and philanthropist reportedly jumped to his death from his Los Angeles home. Steve's son Damian Hurley, who the producer shared with actress Elizabeth Hurley, took to Instagram to thank his followers for reaching out after the devastating news. Thank you from the bottom of my heart to everyone that has reached out following the devastating news. I'm trying to reply to as many of you as I can, but please know I will always remember your kindness. This is a very strange and confusing time, and I'm immensely grateful to be surrounded by my phenomenal family and friends. Steve's ex Elizabeth also took to Instagram following her former beau's death. The two separated in the early 2000s, but Elizabeth shared that the two had grown close again. The 55-year-old shared her sadness alongside throwback photos of the two together. I am saddened beyond belief that my ex Steve is no longer with us. It is a terrible end. Our time together was very happy and I'm posting these pictures because although we went through some tough times, it's the good, wonderful memories of a sweet, kind man that matter. In the past year, we had become close again. We last spoke on our son's 18th birthday. This is devastating news and I thank everyone for their lovely messages. Bing was a big name in Hollywood behind the scenes, backing multiple major Hollywood projects and initiatives including The Polar Express, Beowulf, and more. In 2012, he pledged $30 million to the Motion Picture and Television Fund, a legacy gift which prompted Jeffrey Katzenberg to call Bing, quote, one of the most philanthropic and generous people in our industry. His screenwriting credits include 2003's Kangaroo Jack, and he served as executive producer on feature films such as Get Carter and more. As a political donor, he reportedly gave tens of millions to multiple progressive initiatives, including $10 million to the Clinton Foundation.